Welcome to RenéEnergy.com, your renewable energy and sustainability platform. Hello and welcome back to RenéEnergy.com, your go-to platform for everything renewable energy and sustainability. Today, we have something truly special in store for you. We're peeling back the layers on a technological marvel that is shaking up the hydrogen storage and transportation sectors. We're talking about liquid organic hydrogen carriers, commonly known as low HCs. But this isn't your run-of-the-mill discussion. We're spotlighting Honeywell's pioneering approach to low HC technology, an innovation that has the potential to flip the hydrogen economy on its head. Imagine leveraging our existing infrastructure while transporting hydrogen in a way that's not just efficient but also incredibly safe. Curious? You should be. Stay with us as we dissect how Honeywell's low HCs are making this dream a reality and what it means for our sustainable future. This is a conversation you'll definitely want to be part of. What are low HCs? Liquid organic hydrogen carriers, or low HCs, are specialized organic compounds designed to safely and efficiently store and transport hydrogen. Hydrogen, as we know, is a highly promising renewable energy source, but its gaseous form presents challenges for storage and transportation. This is where low HCs come into the picture, offering an ingenious solution that transforms hydrogen gas into a liquid form. Significance in Renewable Energy Storage and Transportation 1. Safe Storage Low HCs chemically bind with hydrogen, reducing risks associated with its flammable nature. 2. Transportability Being in liquid form, hydrogen can be moved using existing fossil fuel infrastructure, avoiding the need to build new, specialized transportation systems. 3. Scalability, low HCs open the door for mass storage and large-scale transportation of hydrogen, a crucial factor in realizing its potential as a global energy carrier. 4. Efficiency, by leveraging existing infrastructure and simplifying storage, low HCs can potentially lower the overall costs associated with hydrogen energy deployment. For anyone invested in the future of renewable energy, understanding the role of low HCs is crucial. They not only solve some of the most challenging issues around hydrogen but also represent a significant leap towards a more sustainable energy landscape. Honeywell's Low HC Solution When it comes to low HC technology, Honeywell is pioneering the future. Aimed at transforming the way hydrogen is stored and transported, Honeywell's Low HC Solution is engineered for long-distance, cost-effective shipping of this clean energy source. This innovation is particularly groundbreaking because it capitalizes on existing refinery and transportation infrastructure, making the transition to a hydrogen economy smoother and more financially viable. Key processes involved. 1. Honeywell UOP Toluene Saturation Process This is the first crucial step in Honeywell's low HC technology. In this process, hydrogen gas is chemically bonded with toluene to form a liquid carrier, which essentially turns it into a form compatible with existing infrastructure. This liquid carrier can be conveniently moved in the same way we transport gasoline or other hydrocarbons. 2. Honeywell UOP Methyl Cyclohexane Dehydrogenation Process Once the liquid carrier reaches its destination, this process takes over to release the stored hydrogen. The liquid goes through dehydrogenation, and hydrogen gas is extracted, ready to be used in various industrial and commercial applications. Why it's revolutionary? What makes Honeywell's approach particularly remarkable is its ability to utilize idle oil refining assets, providing a seamless transition strategy towards a cleaner, hydrogen-based economy. Not only does it open up new avenues for long-distance hydrogen transportation, but it also addresses storage and safety concerns. Why low HCs are a good fit for renewable energy. In the quest for a sustainable future, low HC technology is emerging as an exciting frontier. The technology not only enhances hydrogen storage but also provides a compelling solution for grid-scale storage, transportation, and scalability challenges that often plague renewable energy projects. Grid-scale storage Low HCs offer a unique proposition when it comes to storing energy on a large scale. Traditional batteries have a number of limitations, such as degradation over time and challenges with storing large amounts of energy. Low HCs, on the other hand, can hold hydrogen, the fuel of the future, in a stable and safe liquid form. This opens up possibilities for buffering the irregular energy production patterns typical of renewable sources like solar and wind. Transportation The transportation of hydrogen gas has always been a significant bottleneck in its widespread use. Being light and flammable, hydrogen gas is hard to move around safely. Low HC technology eliminates this issue by storing hydrogen in a non-volatile liquid form. This liquid can then be transported using our existing fossil fuel infrastructure, think pipelines, ships, and trucks, 
making it an incredibly efficient and cost-effective solution. Scalability. One of the most appealing aspects of low HC technology is its scalability. Since it can leverage existing infrastructure, it is much easier to implement on a large scale. Imagine not having to build a separate, expensive infrastructure but simply modifying what we already have. This drastically reduces entry barriers for new players in the hydrogen economy and allows for rapid scaling of renewable energy projects. The bottom line. With their unique attributes in storage and transport, along with the capability for quick scaling, low HCs have a pivotal role to play in advancing renewable energy projects. They serve as a bridge technology that can accelerate our shift from fossil fuels to a cleaner, greener energy landscape. Comparing low HCs and other storage methods. When it comes to hydrogen storage, there are several methods in play, each with its own set of advantages and drawbacks. In this segment, we will dive into a comparative analysis between liquid organic hydrogen carriers, low HCs, ammonia, and other prevalent hydrogen storage methods. Low HCs. As we've discussed, low HCs offer an innovative approach to hydrogen storage and transportation by chemically binding hydrogen in a non-volatile liquid. This liquid is compatible with existing infrastructure and offers a high degree of safety. Low HCs can be thought of as the sleeper agents in the hydrogen economy, quietly holding large amounts of hydrogen without drawing attention. Ammonia. Ammonia has also been considered a viable hydrogen carrier. It is relatively easy to liquefy and has a high hydrogen density. However, ammonia has some downsides such as toxicity and the need for specialized, corrosion-resistant storage and transportation equipment. Moreover, releasing the hydrogen from ammonia is not as straightforward and often requires high temperatures. Compressed and liquid hydrogen. Compressed hydrogen is another popular storage method but comes with challenges such as the need for high-pressure storage tanks, which can be both expensive and potentially hazardous. Liquid hydrogen, on the other hand, requires extremely low temperatures, adding complexity and cost to its storage and transport. Underground and chemical storage. Some of the other options include underground storage in geological formations and chemical storage in substances like methanol or dimethyl ether. While these methods can store large quantities of hydrogen, they often come with their own sets of challenges such as geographical limitations for underground storage or additional processing steps for chemical storage. Implications for the hydrogen economy The hydrogen economy is often cited as a linchpin in achieving a sustainable, low-carbon future. From fuel cells to industrial processes, the applications of hydrogen are both diverse and increasingly integral to reaching global climate targets. But for all its promise, hydrogen has historically been plagued by issues of efficient storage and transportation. That's where low HCs, and specifically Honeywell's groundbreaking solution, come into play. The industry game changer, Honeywell's low HCs. Honeywell's liquid organic hydrogen carrier, LOHC, technology is not just another incremental step, it's a leap forward. The technology allows for long-distance transport of hydrogen without the need for new and specialized infrastructure. This could revolutionize sectors from transportation to heavy industry, and even residential energy use. By using the existing refinery and transport networks, Honeywell's low HC solution is accelerating the adoption of hydrogen technologies at a scale we've never seen before. Climate goals within reach. The promise of hydrogen as a clean energy source is massive, but it's often offset by the challenges tied to its storage and transportation. Low HC technology is a game changer in this regard. By enhancing the efficiency and reducing the costs associated with hydrogen logistics, we are essentially bringing climate goals within closer reach. Honeywell's solution offers an effective, quick-to-implement route for reducing carbon emissions across multiple sectors, from manufacturing to transportation. A kickstart for hydrogen ecosystems. Imagine a world where hydrogen refueling stations are as common as gasoline stations, and heavy-duty trucks powered by hydrogen roam our highways. That could be our reality with low HCs. Honeywell's innovative approach can serve as the catalyst that kickstarts local, regional, and even global hydrogen ecosystems. As more industries adopt this technology, we could see a cascading effect where the benefits compound, further accelerating our transition to a hydrogen-based economy. The implications are clear, low HC technology, especially as developed by Honeywell, has the potential to radically reshape the hydrogen economy and help us meet, or even exceed, our ambitious climate goals. So, if you're excited about the future of renewable energy and want to stay updated on breakthrough technologies like this, keep it locked here on RenewEnergy.com. We've got plenty more eye-opening content coming your way. Siemens Mobility and Helmholtz Institute, Low HC and Rail Transport. Now, 
If you thought low HCs were confined only to refineries and fuel stations, think again. One of the most intriguing developments in this space is its application in rail transport. Siemens Mobility, a name synonymous with innovation in the transport sector, has partnered with the Helmholtz Institute Erlangen Nuremberg for Renewable Energy to explore the potential of low HC technology in powering trains. A meeting of innovators. When two giants in their respective fields collaborate, you can bet something exciting is on the horizon. Siemens Mobility is already a forerunner in hydrogen-powered train technology with their Mirio Plus H trains. These trains typically rely on high-pressure hydrogen tanks. However, the low HC technology developed by the Helmholtz Institute offers an alternative that eliminates the need for such high-pressure storage, making it not just safer but also more efficient. Low HCs on rails. How does this work, you ask? The Helmholtz Institute's low HC technology uses an organic carrier liquid that absorbs hydrogen and releases it as needed. This means the hydrogen is chemically bound in a liquid form, allowing it to be stored and transported safely and inexpensively. What's more, low HCs can be used for onboard electrical power generation. This compatibility with existing rail infrastructure makes low HCs an attractive option for transitioning to cleaner, more sustainable rail systems. A sustainable vision for rail transport. The partnership promises to put low HC technology to the test by incorporating it into Siemens Mobility's Vectron mainline locomotives. As both organizations are committed to sustainable, climate-neutral rail transport, the successful implementation of low HCs could serve as a template for the future of rail, and another leap towards a hydrogen-powered world. Conclusion Well, there you have it, folks, a deep dive into the fascinating world of liquid organic hydrogen carriers. It's clear that low HC technology is not just another buzzword, it's a game-changer with the potential to revolutionize how we store, transport, and utilize hydrogen across multiple sectors. Honeywell's pioneering solutions in this arena are truly breaking down the barriers that have held back the hydrogen economy, offering a safer, more efficient, and more scalable alternative to traditional methods. And it doesn't stop there. From transforming our existing refinery infrastructure to pushing the boundaries of what's possible in rail transport, low HCs are truly opening doors to a cleaner, more sustainable future. So, are you excited about the boundless possibilities that low HC technology brings to the table? We certainly are. And if you're as passionate as we are about sustainable innovations, make sure to visit our website, reneeenergy.com, for more in-depth articles, reports, and opportunities to get involved in low HC-related projects. Don't miss out on being a part of this exciting journey toward a more sustainable future. Keep watching, keep learning, and keep innovating, right here on reneeenergy.com. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for choosing reneeenergy.com as your go-to source for all things renewable energy and sustainability. With our YouTube channel, we explore the latest developments and innovations in the field, including hydrogen fuel cells and the use of AI and machine learning to optimize energy consumption. If you're ready to take the next step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future, visit us at reneeenergy.com and discover the many ways we can help you transition to renewable energy. Thank you for watching and subscribing. Stay up to date on all the latest news and insights by subscribing today.